Hello everyone, Samantha Goodney here with you and I've got a really cool marketing tip to share with you. Have you ever been scrolling through someone's Instagram page? You go on and you notice that within a post they say information in the bio. And then when you go to the bio, you may see a link. Now, predominantly for um, Instagram, but sometimes for some of the other social pages, you'll notice that you can't put multiple links. And even if you embed the links, nobody can actually touch them because they're not active or live. Today, I'm going to be showing you a way that you can have a link inside of your Instagram or any of your social pages, which will lead people directly to where you want them to go. But this cool tip that I'm going to share with you is also for those of you who may have multiple things you want people to know about you, but you don't have a website that's up and running yet. The trick that I'm going to share with you is just as good as, if not better than a website, because it allows you to send people to multiple interests that you may have. And this particular tip is called Linktree. I got this tip from one of my mentors, um, uh, Rhonda Swan. Love you, Rhonda. And Rhonda was talking one day about one link and how she uses one link to be sure that people can see multiple things that she's doing all at one time. She said the moment she started putting one link into play, all of her um, funnels and her promotions started getting more eyeballs because she started driving people there. And this is something that we're going to cover in another form of marketing, which I have found is phenomenal called intent based marketing or attraction marketing. But for today, let's stay focused. So when she told me about Linktree, I saw so many, so many applications for this. And today I'm just going to give you this as two examples. If you're able to use it in another way, let me know. So you're either going to start using this as your primary link in your social media, on your Instagram, etc., or you can use this in exchange for having a website. And I'll show you how to do that. So when you go to Linktree, when you go to um, Linktree, it's L-I-N-K-T-R dot E-E. And it's going to give you the option to log in. I'm already logged in, but you'll log in. You'll create your account, which is free. And then it'll give you the option to go in as admin. When you go in as admin, you can design how you want inside of here to look. I've already got several links that are active inside of here. But what's cool is that for the free version, which is the one that I have up here, it's going to show you what your settings are so you can decide if you want to put your image in if you want your image the way you want your image to appear you can decide what your color palette is going to be when people actually get to your page what is it that they see how do they feel about you that's actually pretty cool i've never used that i'm usually actually the other way around so as you can see there are tons of options here i usually keep it very simple and i have black on white or white on black. Any of you who follow me, you'll probably know that's kind of my style. But you can use whatever you want, whatever, you know, tickles your fancy. Um, I have one of my best friends who loves teal and blue, so she'll probably love this option. But I'm going to go back to the black and white. In the pro version, you get even more stats. But guys, you don't need all of that for right now. Let's go into the links and see how this can work for you. All right. If you have a link, for um, example, I've got a few active links here, and over onto profile view, this is how it's going to appear on somebody's mobile phone. But the cool thing about this is it also has a view on desktop, which I'll show you in a few. So um, I had actually created for you guys an example when I was just practicing and making sure that things were cool. So I'm going to delete the example and do it again, um, just so that I can show you some of the easy functionality here. So down below here, you'll notice that there are a few different options for things that you can do. So here's delete, so we can delete this. Um, for the stats, it, you can have it show you stats. You can actually have it put a schedule so with pro you could schedule when you want your links to appear and disappear but you can do that manually 
You can also create a priority link so that the links, the particular links are seen more than others. But once again, with the free version, you don't even need to do that. Then if you want, you can create a thumbnail for your link. All of this happens with um, Linktree Pro. And then you have the opportunity to have a leap link. So this is a link that you can temporarily forward to visitors, which gives them a direct destination that, to allow them to bypass Linktree. But there's another way to do that, which I'm going to share with you shortly. So right now, the option that we want to go with is we want to delete this. So we're going to go ahead. It asks us, are you sure you want to delete this link? This action cannot be undone. That's no problem. We're going to delete it. So if you notice over here, that button no longer exists. Let's create a brand new button. Okay. So I'm going to get rid of some of the uh, other options. I'm just going to have about Samantha and I'm going to create a new link. And for the purposes of today, I'm going to create a link, which is called my marketing launch secrets. Ooh, the secrets crew. Okay. My marketing launch secrets crew. Now you'll notice that here, this little bar, this toddle bar is in yellow and it's in yellow because there's no URL here yet. And this can't be used. So I'm going to put as a URL, I'm going to put Samantha Gooden.com. Here is where you would put whatever your URL is, Samantha Gooden.com. Um, you'd put whatever your URL is, and now you have the option to either turn this on or off. If you turn it on, it is going to appear right here in the profile view. However, you can move things around. Maybe you don't want that to be the number one um, button that people see. Right now, you can do this for multiple things. One of the reasons I love LinkedIn, um, linked link tree. One of the reasons I love Linktree is because it allows me to share multiple interests all at the same time. And let me show you what I'm talking about. So let's see what things would look like on a desktop. I can copy that link. I can just add that. And this is what the desktop version will look like. The two buttons that were activated over inside of admin. But what if I wanted to add something else? So I've got a free digital marketing training that's available. And um, I actually just launched a new program called Marketing Launch Secrets Mastery. So I'm also going to put that. And um, last week I launched my album and you can stream my album free here on Spotify. So I'm also going to put that in. And you'll notice as I toggled on these little areas and made them active. Now they appear on the profile view. Let's see what that's going to look like on the desktop view. If I just refresh this link, I love this about Linktree because um, there you go. Oh, everything is real time. It's now going to appear with these links. Now, this is what is cool about it. You can have multiple links that are being pointed in a direction that you want them to, even if you don't have a website. So for me, I've got, um, I've got one of these links, which is just an area where people can get my bio and information about me. Um, this one is the one that I created today and I put it to samanthagoon.com. So it's going to actually point back here. So that's a little pointless, but let me show you this one. I've got free. Um, this is my sales funnel. This is a sales funnel training that I've got going with one of my mentors. And then this one is my new program. I'm really proud of this one. Um, the marketing launch secrets, uh, training program, which is going to launch in another few days. So as you can see, this is multiple areas, multiple places that I can send people to all just by them using this link tree link. And there's one other one right here. If you have Spotify, you can go ahead and play. You can, you can go ahead and play music um, all for free. And that comes from here. So you're able with just one link to get people to know all about you. And this is absolutely free. It's a great option. Even if you do have a website, sometimes websites can be hard to go around. And that's why for the last several months, I've been studying sales funnels and marketing funnels and the integration between online and offline. But I won't geek out on that right now. When I found Linktree as a solution, I thought that it was absolutely 
brilliant. So that's kind of our, our session for today. Wanted to keep it something that's very relevant to everyone, something that you can use right away. You now have the um, option, go to Linktree, make a free brand new, spanking new, make a free um, account and go in there and start playing around with it. Now, for those of you who want to get a little bit more technical, I've, I, I, I did an added step here. I did a URL redirect. And this is why I say it's really great for you even if you don't have a website. So you'll notice that my handle here on Linktree is marketing is passion because it is uh, a passion for me. But um, I wanted for people to get to this place after put in samanthagooden.com. So if you have a URL that your favorite URL, you can redirect your favorite URL directly to the URL here. And if you want to find out what that link is, it's right here inside of your admin page. It shows you what your link is. You'd copy this link, you'd put it into whoever your domain provider is, and voila, you would then be redirecting people from your domain name directly to here, Linktree. Okay, I hope that has been helpful for you. This is something we can all do. Um, you'll notice I, I talk about, and there's a, there's a free tool in Unit 1 now, which just talks about how you can clean up your social media so people can find you some more. Using a link like this is going to make cleaning up your social media even easier. All right, guys. I'm Samantha Gooden. It's been my pleasure to be here with you. Hope that you got some great value out of this. Tell me how you use Linktree and how it helps you out.